Now you could be asked to round a number to the nearest integer. And the word is spelt I-N-T-E-G-E-R. And some people pronounce it integer mistakenly. Okay? So this is integer. And an integer is a whole number. It is the special mathsy word for whole number. Or unit. Okay? So unit is a whole is that place value, okay, where we are one to the left of the decimal point. So if I look at the number three point eight two seven, then this was the unit's column. Okay? So if you go back and you look at the video that I made right at the beginning, then we looked at place value. This is the unit's uh, column. Okay? These are where we're looking at the whole numbers. So, what we want is if I'm going to round this to the nearest integer, then this is the, you, we're looking at the units column. And in all the ways, in all the same uh, cases that we've been looking at before, we identify the place value that we're considering we look one to the right, and that will determine whether we should round up or round down. Okay? So effectively what I've done is I've split my number line up into units. So I have 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, etc. And 3.827 is roughly about here. So that 8 is telling me that I need to round up, so I would round this to 4 to the nearest integer. I've got a very squeaky pen. Okay? So that is 4 to the nearest integer. If I had um, 25.386, then once again, rounding to this to the nearest integer, I look at the integer column, the units column, I look one to the right. The number to the right is less than 5. So I would round this down to 25, to the nearest integer. So, identifying this on a number line, I've split up into units. So I have 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, etc. 25.386 is roughly about there. So you can see that it is closer to 25 than to 26. So this is how you round to the nearest integer. It's exactly the same question as rounding to the nearest unit or rounding to the nearest whole number. All three of these questions mean exactly the same thing. Okay? So don't let it confuse you.